Guys, it's Grizzly. I am going to be doing a tutorial today. It's going to be on the start, which I've done in Bengas. It's like the blue labels coming out of the side of the man's body and going back in. I've masked with his pen tool in this, so this is practically going to get. So let's just get started. Right, drag this in. I'm going and then duplicate it by doing. Command D or Control D, Mac or Windows, and then you just zoom in to whatever you want, then drag it up, start wherever you want. I'm just going to start on the shoulder. So I'll get back to you once it's done because it's going to take about a couple of minutes to do. So be right back, guys. Right, I'm back, guys. I've just finished it now. So uh, there you go. Yours is obviously going to look a lot better. I've just done this in a quick amount of time. So I'm just going to add some. Blur, golden blur onto the back one. So blur, golden blur, just bring it up to about three and some feather onto that. So mask feather, press F on your keyboard, bring it out a bit, and then that'll look okay. Now you've got the issue, you'll realise by just you can move it around. So I'll keep it there. So now I'm gonna make that label thing like the the that thing I can't even explain what it is. So just make a new composition, I'm gonna make that about five seconds. There we go. Get a box, I'm gonna make it blue like I've already done. Because I've done this tutorial once and it failed a bit. So there we go. Add some text into it, I'm just gonna write Tutorial. There, I'll move that there into the middle of it. Scale it down. Perfect. Now I'm gonna make this. I'm gonna call this comp label. I always forget to name them. The label. I spelled that wrong, but oh well. I think I have anyway. So and then I'm just gonna scale it down a bit. Right, that to there, make sure it's the right size for the body so you can't see it perfect so now you need to go to press P and keyframe it, keyframing is a stopwatch I don't know what keyframing is I'm going to bring it out, I'm going to make it 30 frames there and leave it for a whole second so it's one second 30 frames keyframe it by pressing the little diamond and then put it to two seconds and put it back in now I always do that and put it right back into the middle so now you have this there so I'll just play that through from the beginning Oh, you get on me. So it just goes through and goes back in. And you can do it any part of the body, anywhere. But say if you put it here, you'll obviously be able to see it through. Like I put it underneath, you'll obviously be able to see it through the leg. So let me scale it. So you'll need to adjust it by see the mask and bring it all the way down, out of the way. And doing this, you'll most likely have to take away the blur at the back. So just go up to there and see, and then you won't be able to see it. Like in the back, except for a little bit, which I can sort out. So there, we'll move that down. See, there. So you need to really need to do, guys, and thank you for watching my tutorial. I'll put links in the description for download for the clip without colour correction with colour correction so if you want to try it out and I will put a link for the colour correction preset uh, in the description so thank you guys for watching and bye